So in this video, now we'll try to understand how to create that new table with existing table with their uh, existing whatever definition or with their values or without their um, values. So now first thing I will go and try to do that. So this one is one table where we have three rows and two columns. I We have column one and column two and that table name is TBL name. So now what I can do that syntax to create that new table, select star, okay, into, I will put that TBL2 from this table name, okay, from this table, okay. And if I go ahead and execute this one, we can, so we can see that three rows affected and this table got created, okay. So now if I go ahead and try to select this one. This table. We can see exactly same value will copy here and same definition will be there whatever we have for this one. Okay. So this one is one way that now I'm going to create that table with their values. So now this is in the same database i am there and then doing it out okay so now i will try to create now one more table from different database with only some selected columns okay so now if before that last time i forgot to show you i will try to create one new table the table name i will see so i will try select a star from tbl3 so you can see that invalid object name so we'll try to create this table now here and this time what I can do, I can use this table with some of those selected values, okay. That, so what I can do, I can go ahead and put that select star. Okay. This one into TBL3 and from so right now we are in different DB. Now we need to use that complete path. Okay. So here, if I pass that complete path, first one database name, then a schema name, and then table name. Okay. And then I am going to insert into this table. If I need, I can put it where clause as well. So if I can go, I can do one more time and create table, and then I will show you. So first thing, if you can see in this one, we have total. Okay, I will remove that top thousand so that we will get to know total how many rows are there. So we can see that one nine nine seven two rows are there, or you can see it here as well. Now I'm going to insert this one, and we can see it will going to insert one nine nine seven two rows. How much in this table we have? Okay. And now if I go ahead and try to do that, select star from TBL3. So we can see now it's 19972 same rows are coming how much we have inserted. Okay, so this one is second thing that we can do from different DB and with <coughs> selected column. Now, same thing I will go ahead and try to do with where clause and I will create one more table that called TPL4. I can try to do. Okay. Put TPL4 and then I will try to do where title is not null. I will put title is not null. And then I will try to do that. So now if I can go ahead and try to execute this one. So we can see that one zero zero nine row got affected. And if I go and execute this one, you can see now all those values came where title have that value. Okay. So this one, that other way, how we can go ahead and try to do that values. But now if I go and try to so you one more thing. Now I wanted to create that new table with that existing table structure. 
with only selected columns but i don't wanted to use their values okay i wanted this table to be blank so four already created now i will try to create five okay. so before that i will again show you but this table is not exist so now what i need to do i'm going to just put where one equals to two okay so if i put where one equals to two so since that condition is not correct so it will not insert any value only it will create table for us with that existing definition and all those other things so now if i go ahead and execute we can so see that zero row got affected okay and is in the end that condition is not true and it's created that table structure with existing table structure from where we wanted to copy and now we can create that we can insert that new rows based on our requirement okay so in this way you can create new tables okay based on existing tables with their values without their values and with selected columns and with all columns i hope you like this video thank you